everybody, this is Praxis, and I'm back at work working on the chicken coop. I've put in several hours this morning, and I was able to get uh, the beginning of a second tier of bricks all the way around to, uh, to here. And I poured a little bit of this kind of footing, and I waited for this to stiffen up, and I'm going to throw a few more bricks onto this area here. Uh, I'm continuing to like this device right here. I'm pretty tired after all the work I did this morning, but this makes it a lot easier. One thing that I noticed with this though, if I had designed one of these and I had tried using it once, I think I pretty quickly would have realized that the fact that they've got bolts sticking into the inside to kind of hold the, the drum onto the, uh, the rotating motor, the fact that you have those bolts sticking up, it makes it sometimes hard to uh, scoop concrete out of there because you'll, you'll go in, you'll hit, you'll hit a bolt in the bottom. So if you're ever looking to get one of these for yourself, uh, see if they have bolts sticking out of the inside and, you know, decide whether or not you want to maybe mess with that or not. Because I find when I'm trying to scrape the bottom of the, the barrel that I'm always kind of hitting into the bolts in there. It's not something I would have uh, necessarily thought of, uh, you know, buying it. This is the first time I've ever used one of these. But certainly if I'd, I'd manufactured one of these myself and I'd ever tested it, that would have been something that would have uh, immediately jumped out at me that, wow, it's, you know, kind of awkward to uh, get stuff out of here. Um, you yeah, know, just my thoughts as a layperson using it. So, uh, I'm going to be continuing uh, this run of bricks over here. Uh, the grade here is kind of bumpy. Uh, the only place I'm not going to be able to put a brick is way over in the corner there because there's a big boulder right there. But, uh, but otherwise, uh, this will be a, a contiguous uh, run of uh, bricks. And then the third layer over this is going to be uh, contiguous completely, including over that corner right there. Uh, I think that the third course is probably the highest it's going to go over here. I, I, might, I don't think I'm going to do a fourth course. I think, I think it'll be three courses uh, on this side, and then these other ones are going to come up to, to here or so. That's it. Thanks for watching.